everybody, what is up? Welcome back to another week in my life in New York City. Today is a fun day because today's Tuesday, so I'm gonna be taking you guys along my week per usual. We've got a big day and a big week ahead of us, so we're gonna start off by heading over to the Gals in the Go studio. Brooke and I are recording this week's episode of Gals in the Go podcast. If you didn't know, I have a podcast from my best friend Brooke. It's a good time. <laughs> and then I'll head back home, do a ton of computer worky worky stuff. And then I'm actually getting my extensions bumped up because my hair is growing, which is exciting. But so my extensions are kind of like loosely flying in the wind, I feel like. So we're going to get those bumped. I also am kind of curious what my hair looks like without my extensions. But I don't know if we're going to do that today or not. So I'm going to see Mad's hair. And then after that, I think I'm just coming back here and chilling and relaxing and just setting my intentions for the week. Um, I was traveling last week. My friends, my hallmates are coming this Thursday, which I'm really excited about. They're coming to stay with me in the city. Some of them have never been to New York, so I'm a little nervous. I feel like I have so much pressure on me. So they're all landing like Thursday night. So I have to like prep my apartment and everything before that. Anyways, welcome back to another week of my life. I'm so excited. And yeah, let's go get ready. All right, we're in the bathroom now. I just brushed my teeth, put on some lip balm. I also need to do my skincare. Um, so I have my hair done from an event last night and it actually lasted while I slept. I think the key is I slept with my hair in a high ponytail and it kept the volume. Like it creased a little bit, but I can fix that with my hair product or with my hair tools. So that's hype. Now it's time to do the makeup. I've showed my makeup a thousand times, so we're just gonna speed up this process. And I have a friend to call, so I'm gonna call her while I do my makeup. Finished getting ready, touched up the hair, makeup. We just did a little glowy moment. Earrings. I'm wearing this sweater bodysuit because it's a 30 degrees in New York City again. I don't know what's happening. It was literally 70 last week. Whatever. Wearing some leather leggings or faux leather leggings. Felt the cowboy boots today. Like I said, it's pretty cold out there and I want some color in my outfit. So we're gonna add this colorful scarf here. Um, and then I guess, oh, I need a jacket, of course. I don't really know if this jacket matches in the slightest, but it's just gonna have to happen. I like the way this jacket looks with this scarf, so we're gonna, gonna do it up. Yeah, this is cute, this is cute, she's cute. All right, let's go. We are in the studio now. I got here a little bit before Brooke. She's almost here. I decided to get a decaf oat milk latte at Starbucks nearby. I don't like get Starbucks anymore since I've lived here. Cause I don't really live near one and I usually just, you know, have a cup in the morning, but it's so nice out. Or well, it's not nice out, but like it was so cold out that it felt like it'd be nice to have a cup of coffee. So yeah, I'm about to record this week's episode, which is gonna be like advice, Q&A, we're picking a couple topics to kind of go off of. So yeah. Hello. Oh, she's got her AirPods on and oh everything. God, it's that kind of day. A gal on Zigo. I've been jamming to Odessa in here. I just listened to the, the new song. Oh. I've been listening to it. Just got back from recording. A lot is happening here. I just got Chipotle because I haven't gotten to get groceries yet, which I need to do. Everything's catching up with me. Going to Sonona was amazing, but now I'm like trying to squeeze so much that I have to get done in like two days. So getting a lot done for the next like two hours and then we have a couple appointments then I'm just gonna come right back here and go to the computer. My apartment's becoming messy again. It's stressing me out. All right, hi guys. Um, it's a little later, I'm feeling better. I got a lot done. Um, I just changed into this little Skims sweatsuit and I'm just putting on my coat as well because it's cold out there as we know. Um, we're headed to European Wax Center, getting my, my wax, you know the drill. And then from there, I think I'm just gonna bring my tote bag with my computer and uh, find a coffee shop or something nearby 
to get the rest of my work done or some of it more done instead of like coming home and then going to my next appointment because I'm getting my extensions bumped up. They feel a little messed up in the back, like tangled and I'm really nervous to see if that's the case. So we're going from European Wax Center, working somewhere over there and then from there gonna go see Matt's hair, bump up the extensions and then hopefully that won't take too long and then come back and lots is to be done. But yeah, sorry, today's vlog is just me running around. I'm really sorry about that. I'm just catching up after um, being away, and I'm always thankful to be busy, of course. But yeah, let's do it. Here's a little outfit. This coat's amazing because it just covers your whole outfit and makes it look cute. Using Kenzie's Okind tote bag. I'm so proud of her. All right, we're gonna start the um, appointments. <laughs> Just walking in the door now. Um, I just did a little extensions bump up with Mads. My hair looks so good, she styled it, which was really nice. I didn't get a blowout, because my hair was like pretty fresh. She just like curled it. But now my extensions are back at the top of my head. They're also a little knotted, because when I was home in Tampa, I was like on the boat and my hair was flying everywhere. Anyways, you guys don't care about that, but so now it'll be even easier to pull my hair back, because as your extensions start to grow, it's a little bit harder to pull your hair back so if you do get hair extensions I suggest having them as high up as possible that helps with that I still have so much to do um and I don't really know where to start and Ryan wanted to hang out tonight and I want to because we haven't really like we were together last night but it was like at a social we haven't got time to like see each other like just be together since I left last week I don't know like quality time but also like I won't be present in the moment with him if I don't like have these certain things done. So I just need to put some music on, clean up in here. I'm glad I unpacked yesterday. I'm so glad if you guys watched my unedited day in my life, you would know. And yeah, I just need to do some computer work, need to record something for the podcast. We are all good. You guys do not care. Sorry, this day is so all over the place, but that's my life, so. <laughs> just lit my candle. It's time to my Coop candle's finally done. So, the exciting part, what do we want to burn now? All kinds of things. Ooh, this New York City candle is a vibe. I feel like I also have, oh yeah, what's in here? I have so many scent things here. Ooh, let's do Jazz Club by Replica. That'll be fun. It's like the tree lighting, but better. No, I'm kidding. Gotta love lighting a candle for the first time though, right? It's laundry folding time. I'm just gonna fold, listen to a podcast, starting to clear the box, it's got some fun PR. I'm starting to feel a little bit better. Also, <laughs> I'm a little crazy and Liquid IV decided to keep grape as a permanent flavor and I freaked out and I was so excited that I bought so many because I'm just scared that they're still gonna take it away somehow. So we should be set for a little bit. I think I got 96. <laughs> it's now 10.30. I'm currently editing the thumbnail for my Sedona vlog that I'm posting tomorrow. I also just took a shower to just feel more fresh, pulled my hair back. I always just need to have my hair out of my face. We're in this little loungewear set. Ryan's gonna come over. I think we're gonna watch like an episode of The Dropout. Um, because we've literally only watched episode one. We're so behind. But yeah, my apartment's starting to feel clean. You can hear my dryer going, laundry's put away. When my apartment's clean, I'm clean. I just feel better. <laughs> Ryan's here. What's up? He just drank out of my LaCroix. How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> We're about to watch um, Dropout. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.
Good morning. It is a Wednesday morning. I've had such a productive morning already. I sat on my couch and got so much done. Feeling refreshed, feeling good. About to go work out. I'm so excited. I'm like in the mood to work out. It's so amazing to finally start being excited to work out again. I love working out with Jane. It's just been so great and I just I'm starting to feel more confident again. So I just thought I'd share that with you guys. This little workout set's from Story Apparel. Story with an I. I love this little short sleeve top situation with the leggings, little gray trim, wearing some aloe socks and my hokas. It's like 38 degrees outside, so we gotta pull out the puffer. I didn't think I'd be wearing that again. Into the coat closet we go. Ah, where are you at, big puffer? Is this it? No, where's my long puffer? We want that one. Wait, actually though, where did it go? I found it. It was hiding behind other coats. My good old Sam jacket. This thing keeps me so warm. I'm so happy I got this. I love the belts and everything. Keeps you strapped up. Um, all right, we've got a bit of a walk to the gym. Using this little tote bag from Wild Fox. This is the, f <laughs> I should probably zip this up. Oh wait, I need water, hold on. All right, I'm bringing this little water bottle today because all my others are dirty right now. I got it on Amazon though, it's kind of nice. Quick ice roll before we leave because I'm about to step out into icy weather. Why wouldn't I <laughs> ice roll my face? I'm kidding, I don't know, it just feels right. I didn't ice roll this morning, I just did eye patches. Oh, this feels so good. Gonna have a good day. What's that song? Gonna have a good day. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> to go get my nails done. They're desperately, these are my Cabo nails. It's time to change them up. We're doing some fun colors today too though. I'm excited. Headed to Mickey, my favorite gal. Brooke was just there and I'm her next client. I think that's funny. I am obsessed with these nails, you guys. I found this on Pinterest, of course, and I haven't seen anyone do this little color combination. I think it's so unique, perfect for spring. It's giving Easter vibes. I love it. Mickey Nail Co. in Lower East Side crushes it. I'm so happy with this. I've set up camp here in the kitchen. Um, about to do everything on my to-do list there. Gonna make some lunch soon. I don't have much. I just ordered groceries too from Instacart. I think I have, yeah, I have some broccoli. I could do broccoli, rice, and beans, question mark? Yes, I've got beans, <laughs> so. That's the one good thing about always having like rice and beans and frozen veggies. It's a good little meal, so I think I'll do that. And this is beyond embarrassing. <laughs> I definitely need to do my dishes. Here is my super random kind of small grocery haul. My Instacart guy just came. Love Instacart. I typically, typically, typically do Wegmans from Instacart. I don't know. They seem to have brands I like. I don't know. I had good experiences. So I got random stuff because I'm gonna be eating out most of this weekend since my hallmates are coming to town. With that being said, I got some things that I thought would be good to have as snacks, like if someone just needs like a quick little chewy bar, 
This is like so child of me, but I love Uncrustables and it's nice. I'll just take them out of the box and put them in my fridge. These peanut butter pretzels are so good. Apples, bananas, needed some more bread. Pita chips to dip in hummus. Carrots for dipping or eating or, you know, chasing fireball with. Um, apples, and I got a thing of chicken noodle soup. Cause it comes in handy when I'm in a pinch, you know? So this is my gal on the go grocery haul. <laughs> These are so not ripe yet, but that's okay. Um, and then I also got some LaCroix. Cause I always like to have a ton in my fridge. So I'm gonna put this all in here now. I also am in dire need of doing another um, beverage of the week. So I think I'm gonna do that today because it's about time. Just ordered also some pressed juicery. I am so pumped about this. I got six ginger shots and then we got six of the greens three. They're literally so delicious. I am obsessed, I'm about to drink one right now. All right, so I just folded my laundry, did the dishes, took out the trash, just prepping for you know, eight girls to come for the weekend, uh, or seven, I'm, I'm the eighth. So, fun little Wednesday night outing. I'm going to see this show called Company, the musical. I'm so excited. I work with Yes Broadway sometimes and they'll send me to new shows or just shows that are wanting some more promotion and I am so pumped. I hear, I believe Company is like a funny musical about trying to put on a musical. I might be wrong, but I'm so excited. I'm bringing my friend Seb. Seb and I went to Georgia together and we've become really close pals here in the city. So I'm so excited and she likes shows, I like shows, so it's a good time. I'm really happy with how my hair looks right now. I just kind of fixed it with my Dyson Airwrap. And then, so I used the curling attachments and then I took the brush attachment and brushed through the curls and I'm very happy with how it looks. Um, so we're having a little night outing, um, a little show. We're not doing dinner before because I just had so much to do and she had work, so it's perfect. Wearing these earrings, I believe they're from Argento Vivo. I love them and people always ask where my second piercing earring is from. I have one on both sides. It's from Cupcakes and Cashmere. It's so cute, it's a little chain earring. Um, wearing my everyday jewelry and then this Skims dress that I absolutely love. I'll show you guys. My mom got it for me for Christmas and I'm so happy because I just ordered this in black and the tank top version. I wanna get this in more colors. It is just so amazing, and I just thought it would be comfortable to sit at the theater. I'm gonna obviously have to wear a jacket because it's quite chilly out, actually, is it? Oh, it's 45 now, but still, a jacket is needed. I don't know what shoes yet. I have these like white heels, but like, is that necessary? I don't know. All right, I decided on this little moment. I love matching the bag with the shoes. So I'm using this bag from Primark. It's my new favorite baby this Skims dress and then these shoes from Steve Madden. I have them in green and I just got them in white as well because they're so comfortable and they literally make me like four inches taller but you, like it's comfortable. You know, I wouldn't walk miles in these but they're comfortable and I'm si these are sitting shoes. You know, I'll be sitting the whole time so it's great. Um, I'm just gonna pop my tan, my beige coat over there. We're gonna head to the theater. Hi guys, it's almost midnight now. Just got back. The show must have been long, so I, didn't, I mean, we left around 11. So it was really, really good. It was so funny. It had a really great message at the end, like you don't have to be in a relationship to be happy, which I completely agree with. It was so funny. It was like a very unique show. The music was so good. I loved the set, it was New York City based, which I love, so go see the company on Broadway. On my way in, I met a lovely subscriber with her mom, it was so sweet, and then on my way out, I met another subscriber who was there on like a theater trip. They were seeing a ton of shows this week. So, shout out to both of you, thank you both for saying hi, it made my life. I always love meeting subscribers at Broadway shows, I'm like, my people. And then right after that, I saw a girl that I went to high school with, she was a few grades older than me, and we did musical theater together. So it was just really, I, I like forgot that she lived in the city, I haven't seen her, in literally years and I was just like oh my gosh you read this show too everyone was at the show tonight so great show highly suggest and yeah now I'm sitting here eating chicken noodle soup I'm telling you guys it always comes in handy because I had that rice and beans and broccoli but then and that was at like four but then the show was at eight and they left at seven so yeah I literally look like I'm drunk right now I haven't had a lick of alcohol I literally just got Sprite I always get Sprite at shows 
Um, and I'm just, my voice is just gone. I'm just sitting here eating chicken no soup, watching Bridgerton season two. It's getting better. Season, episode one was like, eh, but I'm on episode three now and it's good. So anyways, I'm gonna eat this. Tomorrow we have a big spring cleaning day. I'm very excited. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning, everybody. Making coffee, ice rolling, currently in the waiting room. The Odessa concert in August. They're just doing the pre-sale now for tickets and I must go. I'm buying a few tickets for some friends. I'm literally texting with Brooke and my friend Christian right now. It's past 10, I'm like, I need to be in. Oh my gosh, that was so stressful. I wasn't able to get any, but Brooke was able to get eight. So she saved one for me and one for Delaney. I'm so excited, yay. Morning coffee, I'm wearing this set from Wild Fox. If you watch one of my last vlogs, apparently this is like a bachelorette set, but I love it. It's got a ton of wine glasses. I'm really, I'm just like woke up in a daze this morning. I do not know why. We're doing spring cleaning today. Big spring cleaning day. I wanna clean as much as I can and not just like clean, like clean out, like potentially my kitchen cabinets, you know, stuff like that. So we shall see. And I actually do have a cleaning service coming today too. Which I'm really excited about. I use TaskRabbit usually um, because my homemates are coming to stay with me. And my bathroom is like really dirty and I don't know. I'm just like, it'd be nice to, I like to have a cleaning service come every now and then to do like the full sweep up. Um, so yeah, everyone's coming in around like between 7 and 10 p.m. tonight. Three are staying here with me. Four are staying at a hotel nearby. I need to go downstairs at my storage unit and get my air mattress and get that all ready. One girl's gonna stay on the couch, one girl air mattress, one with me. Um, and I just, I don't wanna say I need to like childproof my apartment, but I just wanna like move things around that like they might wanna put their suitcase in that area and stuff like that. So yeah, I need to stop lollygagging because there's just a lot to be done. I need to change the sheets. Ah, my closet's a mess, shoes are bursting out. I might clean out my closet a little bit, see if there's anything I wanna give away. Um, because I have some like PR stuff I want my friends to go through so I'm so blessed I get so much PR But um, so I'll let them take anything home that they want and then also some clothes I'm gonna drink my coffee and wake up a little bit I might put on Bridgerton while I do all this and then we're gonna get to work All right, I ended up having a little bit more computer work than expected to do So it's a little bit later now. I have a lot to do. I wanna do a lot before the cleaning service comes. I can cross a couple things off my to-do list. Okay, I need to take my supplements. I just had a bowl of oatmeal. That was today's breakfast. Um, so I need to take my supplements, but I just realized my pill box is empty. So I need to refill that, do the whole Mancala thing. Um, so that's first up, cause I, I'm trying, I am on a routine of taking them every day, which is awesome. It's past the 21 days. <laughs> um, so. I wanna make sure I stick to that. Take my suitcase and like other stuff down to my storage unit, bring up the air mattress. Um, I guess I don't necessarily need to make my bed. I always do this, I always make my bed when the cleaning service is going and then they usually make it, so I don't know. Might as well save some time there. I also did the dishes yesterday. I'll unload the dishwasher. Okay, yeah, it's not that bad. I just have some things to like put away. Um, so. I had this really ambitious moment of spring cleaning, but I think I should do the what needs to get done before the homemates get here first, and then with extra time, then we'll spring clean. So, sorry I got you guys hyped, but I just need to prioritize things in my brain. Um, oh, I crossed off two other things. I didn't realize I was just finishing up my taxes. I'm such a last minute tax, but like it's literally tax day on April 15th. Like, I was talking to my accountant today. Um, oh, and I got groceries yesterday. <sighs> I should probably, I don't really have time to do that. I need to like turn the page to make a new to-do list because it's like all jumbled now from yesterday. But anyways, I'm ranting. I'm rambling, not ranting. I'm going to put my hair up. We are going to get all the supplements here and fill up my pill box. Let's get after it.
All right, so I forgot to say what I was doing, but I just met up for coffee with JC Marie Smith. She's in town, and it was so good to see her. We met up with Brooke, too. Came back, my apartment was all clean. Um, I used Task Rabbit, I use the same gal every time. She's absolutely amazing. Um, so I walked in, and it literally like, smells clean in here. Obviously, like I had some stuff, so she didn't know what to do with it, but the floors look so good. Oh my gosh, she made my bed, queen. Wow, vacuumed everywhere, it looks amazing in here. It's getting ready for the hallmates. Still haven't brought this stuff down. Running a little bit behind today, but I wanted to make sure I saw JC while she was here. Countdown to the hallmates get here. I'm laughing at myself right now because I drank a latte, like a caffeinated latte, and you guys know I haven't really been drinking caffeine because I was so tired and I was like, I need to be social, my friends are coming tonight, but I am like so jittery and jacked up right now on coffee that I Literally just made a sleepy time tea at 4 45 p.m. Because I need to calm down. Does anyone else relate? Because this is nuts Just brought up the air mattress. It's like a really nice one. It's from Amazon and it's like a tall one Which is nice super plush. It's a twin Brought the um, suitcases down have some more PR um, I need to figure out Amazon sent me this really cool trunk with lots of fun goodies in it um, But now I don't know what to do with it so just figuring that out. I feel like Ryan and his roommates could honestly use this for storage It doesn't really go with the aesthetic. I mean, it doesn't look bad right there, but you know By the way, I'm wearing this sweat set from all my love love the color I feel like it's a good spring sweat set, you know, I think Kelly's gonna come over here in a little bit We're gonna hang out while I clean she's going to Miami next week and she has to borrow some of my clothes and I was like some of my Cabo outfits would be perfect all right, I feel like before all my hallmates come, it would be good. I could sage the apartment, but I'll do that after they leave. Um, I'm going to burn some incense just to clear the air. This retreat has done wonders to me. No, I'm kidding. Um, also, shout out to whoever gave me the tip. I had my incense like this because my last incense holder I had was um, flat, so it like was able to catch everything. But this one, it's around, so I'm th I think... Think I'm supposed to stick it straight up except I mean it's still that's the only thing like the ash falls or whatever that would be and then you have to wipe it off the table but it hasn't been seeming to stain but I'm just gonna do a little I'm gonna light this baby up just light the top here and this one has a nice little lavender situation to it then you blow it out and then it just starts going about to put on Bridgerton and unbox and flatten all the boxes and everything. I don't know if you guys can see that. And a lot of people ask me, like, because I usually, I don't have my candles lit right now, but I'll usually light my candles at the same, oh wait, I don't think I lit it up enough. Hold on, let's see. All right, now I'll blow it out, ready? Ooh. All right, there we go, that's what we wanna see. Good vibes. Oh yeah, so what I was saying is I usually burn candles too. I just like love scent overload, but for, for, for some people that's probably a lot. So, oh wait, did I still not burn it enough? Oh my gosh, whatever. Oh yeah, I smell it now. Incense is lit. Okay. One of the things I got in my Amazon chest is this vegetable slicer, or just like a slicer in general. I am so excited about it. Like I'm always chopping up cucumber and stuff for juices. Apparently I don't need to chop it up to put in my juicer though, but just like other things, I'm so pumped about this. <laughs> All right, I'm just about ready for the homemates to get here. Looking clean, it's looking good. Just organized my closet a little bit more so I can actually shut these doors because I'm sure someone's gonna put their suitcase there. I'm not sure, but it's the best it'll get, so. I'm gonna hop in the shower and like wash my hair and blow it out for like the weekend and I'm gonna start a new vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I feel like it was really, really random. It was just like doing stuff around my apartment, but hopefully you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys next time for our next video. Bye.